Na serikali imetangaza msako dhidi ya vinywaji gushi na dawa za kulevya kabla ya msimu wa siku kuu. Zoezi hilo ambalo litaongozwa na Wizara ya Usalama linatekelezwa na Idara ya Polisi nchini na Mamlaka ya Kitaifa ya kupambana na matumizi ya pombe na dawa za kulevya na kada. Risa Hati ametuandalia taarifa hiyo. Huku wa Kenya wakijiandaa kusherekea Krismasi na mwaka mpya, serikali imetangaza msako dhidi ya vinywaji gushi na dawa za kulevya kote nchini. Akizungumza katika taasisi ya ukuzaji mitala nchini KICD wakati wa mkutano wa mashauriano kabla ya zoezi hilo kuanza, Katibu Mkuu katika Wizara ya Usalama, Daktari Raymond Omolo, alisema kuwa huu ni wakati mwafaka wa msako huo kufanywa kwani kwa kawaida nchi hukumbwa na ongezeko la unywaji pombe haramu na dawa za kulevya wakati wa msimu wa sikukuu. Into the festive seasons we have uh, christmas coming up and then of course the new year and there is expectation that there will be a spike in the increase of substance abuse and uh, hence the need for the various teams that are convening here today to come up with the measures and the me mechanisms of ensuring that uh, we have this under control Omolo hata hivyo amesema kuwa msako huo utalenga tu pombe haramu na dawa za kulevya huku ukilinda biashara zilizo na leseni. Ametoa wito kwa serikali za kaunti kutekeleza ipasavyo jukumu lao la kikatiba katika utoaji wa leseni kwa uzaji vinywaji na udhibiti wa dawa za kulevya. If we have facilities that operate uh, as a spaces for selling the the alcohol they are properly licensed uh, the measures on quality control are in place that uh, whatever alcohol that is being sold whatever uh, drugs whether it's tobacco meet the requirements uh, of the law and uh, this is not to make it difficult for businessmen who are involved in in, in, the, in this trade kwa upande wake inspector generali wa polisi Jafet Koome pia ameonya kuwa maafisa wa polisi hawata stahimili madereva watakaopatikana barabarani wakiwa wamelewa Drivers tend to drink and drive I caution those along our ways Nobody nobody we are not going to allow drunkenness and driving Speeding we are not going to allow that as a mission. That excitement which is seen in the month of December. <coughs> then we start having accidents all over. Last night, last night, evening, last evening, last evening we lost nine lives. Mkutano huo ambao pia ulihudhuriwa na makamishna wote wa kanda unafuatia agizo la hivi majuzi la Rais William Ruto la kuimarisha vita dhidi ya uzalishaji, unywaji na uuzaji wa pombe haramu na mihadarati. Nikiripotia Dira ya Hope TV, Mie ni Grace Ahati.